Hi folks, this is Pastor Dave Grisham here for God and Country Ministries and today it's another episode of Preaching with a View and today we are talking about salmon. Now the salmon in Alaska, in this part, this is Potter's Marsh right outside of Anchorage, Alaska and the salmon come up this river right here that you can see right here behind me, right there. And they come from the Cook Inlet over here to my left. They come through these pipes, they swim through there and they come up the river here. This is just one area where they come in. And they come in in different runs. You'll have the kings and the pinks and you'll have the silvers and you'll have all these different types of salmon running at different times in the summer. And uh, they kind of trickle in at first, then they all come in in big bunches. And then you got a few stragglers at the end, but they come in in phases. Now, what has to happen here, it shows you on this sign, life from death about the salmon. And what the salmon do is they grow up here in the river and then they swim out to the ocean and they live out there for seven years. Seven years, I don't think that's coincidental seven years and then they swim back up to spawn to reproduce now before they get here the beluga whales and the orcas and and dolphins the porpoises and everything are trying to eat them out in the ocean as they gather up to come into the mouth of the river commercial fishermen yeah the commercial fishermen are out there trying to catch them and then they come up the river here and the eagles are swooping down trying to grab them, right? And they're trying to eat them. And the bears, right over there on the other end, there's some bears that like to go over there and that's one of their favorite fishing spots here at Potter's Marsh. And the bears try to eat the salmon. And then, now you can't do it here because there's no commercial fishing allowed here, but, and there's no sports fishing allowed here either, but even the sports fishermen are trying to catch them. So, the salmon have to have to escape the the whales and the porpoises and everything out in the ocean and the commercial fishermen then the sport fishermen then the eagles and then the bears so they can go upstream and reproduce and then they die this is very a very good analogy of the christian life you get born again and then you swim against the current of the world going against the flow of the world, struggling, and it's work. You gotta go, you know, these, these salmon, they'll jump up waterfalls and they really gotta work hard to go against the flow of the river. So Christians have to work hard to go against the flow of the world. Meanwhile, you got false Christians trying to pick them off. You got, you got sinners trying to pick them off. You got the demonic trying to pick them off. You got everything in the world working against you, trying to get you so that you don't go out and evangelize and reproduce. But that is exactly what God wants you to do. And only the strongest, only those that have the strongest faith. Now the fish, you're talking about physical strength. Only the strongest, physically strong fish will survive to reproduce. Only those with the most faith will live long enough through this and persevere to reproduce and make more Christians by evangelizing. So I just wanna encourage you today, as you're going against the stream and you're going against the, everything that's trying to stop you from being a Christian and evangelizing, don't stop. Keep going against the flow, keep going against the world and just keep going and God will eventually have you produce fruit. So God bless you all and you have a good day.